It doesn't get any more tension packed than this. The 2022 FIFA World Cup final. Who is going to come out on top? Stay with us for every kick of the ball right here on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's France versus Argentina. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris between the posts. Rafael Varane plays with Dario Upamecano in central defence. Antoine Griezmann starts alongside Adrien Rabiot in central midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Olivier Giroud. The Argentina first team. Well, it's a defensive looking lineup, but if the wing backs break forward, the midfield can get close to the front pair and the front two can link up with each other. They should still cause problems today. And the match is underway. Mbappé it's a splendid run by Mbappé and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end Alvarez chance to cross Takes aim. Terrific block. Now defenders having to cover up. Well, France are the holders. Not too many people doubted them coming into the tournament. And quite frankly, they've rubber stamped their credentials. Oh, so can he finish it here, Derek? Palms away by the keeper. No nonsense clearance. And it's the vision of Griezmann coming to the fore. And the keeper diving to thwart him. short corner here Mbappe now with Rabiot and there it is living history the opening goal of the 2022 World Cup final incredible celebrations
And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Lionel Messi, he's in here. Oh, a goal it is! The equaliser in this final. What next in the drama? Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So back underway. One goal apiece here. Number 10, Lionel Messi. Griezmann. Griezmann. Oh, a smart stop. It's a short corner. And Bale with the cross. Not a bit short with the clearance. Oh, a goal to give them the lead. And look at the celebrations. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. So there we have it, 2-1. Rodrigo de Paul. Alexis McAllister. Good technique displayed. And he's broken free. Oh, there it is! A back and forth sort of the match. Now they're level again. The lead lasted nearly minutes. Well, here we can see it again. It's a lovely ball in behind. Perfectly timed. And Lionel Messi does the rest. He strikes it so clearly, he hits it with power and accuracy. There's no stopping that one. Goal. So the ball is running again at 2 all. Number 10, Lionel Messi. Well, they've given him too much space but quick thinking defensively this might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity and a good looking ball Messi he's got to score how did he manage to reach that Hugo Lloris Well, he's gone short with it. And making the run to the inside. Terrific piece of anticipation. Jihou. Really nice ball. And they could do damage. Well, here it is again. The ball over the top is an absolute beauty. And Mbappe just hits it with such confidence. He strikes it so cleanly. It's a great goal.
two it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Enzo Fernandez might really be able to trouble them here. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Could be a chance to break here. All hands on deck. Tempele. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. Rodrigo de Paul. Read it well. Giroud. Well, as we can see here, the pass from Griezmann is absolutely perfect. And Mbappe's movement and penalty box awareness makes that finish look easy. That's a really good goal. Goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Number 10, Kylian Mbappe. Determined defending. Well, no surprise there. France have enjoyed most of the possession and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Lionel Messi, he's in behind. Oh, incredible save, and he's snuffed out any sign of danger. Being pressed hard, and far from a smooth challenge. Now will the referee produce a card? And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Now Griezmann. Zero. A smart stop here. And a short corner, let's see. Is he going to put it away? Griezmann. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Messi. De Paul. A real opening now. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Well, they won't come much closer than that. It's a matter of inches from being a really good goal. But well, it should boost their confidence, but they can't afford to drop their guard at the other end. Oh, big chance! Spectacular save, top-class goalkeeping. The high press was very much on. Tempele. Can they do something positive? on the counter-attack. And they could get one back here. And a goal to seal the hat-trick! A masterclass in finishing! Just can't stop him today! Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal.
Neither side shy about shooting in this match. Number 10, Lionel Messi. Giroud. Otamendi attending to his defensive chores. And the cross didn't beat the first man. Enzo Fernandez. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. This could square the game just as well from the defensive point of view that he was able to make that interception who can he pick out Messi and here he is Lionel Messi splendid defending a really sumptuous ball Mbappe Tempele. Oh, big opportunity. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, as you can see, this is a great pass from Dembele. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So then, we're at the halfway stage in this match. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Well, very effective play in possession. He knows he's got to react. It might be. And diving to thwart him. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Whipped in by Griezmann. A deft clearance. Griezmann. And the cross not quite imaginative enough. And giving the ball away. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Fernandez. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Enzo Fernandez. De Paul. Now, what can they do from here? Di Maria. Well, the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend. Oh, good save. Excellent header. And that will be a corner. They're going for the short one. And the cross is immediately dealt with. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Griezmann. Can he find the right pass? A glorious chance. And that's the hat trick. Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, just watch this again. Griezmann's pass is inch perfect, but the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping.
And the action underway once more with France very much on top. Nicely cut out. Giroud. Teammates available. And what can they produce on the flank? Well played in from the flank, but not to any great effect. And he takes it away. And he's broken free. And a goal! He's put it away. A celebratory moment. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. And time for the change now. Goal for Argentina. Kylian Mbappe. <laughs> Mbappe. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Lisandro Martinez. Di Maria. And it would have been a chance, but the run was mistimed offside. Really good challenge. Now options are plenty. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Di Maria. Beautifully weighted ball. Griezmann. Well, the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. <laughs> and short it is. And Giroud now at the controls. The crossbar is still reverberating. Well, they survived the attack. Just the clearance that was called for. Mbappe. It's there for him. Oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? But he's gone short with it. Mbappe in the centre. Not quite the cross he was hoping for. Lionel Messi. He continues his run. And still pressing. Oh, did so well to deny him. They take it short. It comes to absolutely nothing. Messi. 
Marcos Acuna, Di Maria. How did he manage to reach that? Hugo Lloris. Short corner favour. Marcos Acuna, determined defending. Nicely timed tackle. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Coman. Coman! Can they cover up? And a time for cool heads. Rodrigo de Paul. Plenty of running room in the wide position. Now this could really lift spirits. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. So a personnel change then. Going short. Has a go. Still could be dangerous. Well, nothing comes of it. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Rabio, and in with a real chance. Well, the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend. And in the end, no damage done. Martinez. On to Messi. Not advantage with them. Referee says play on. Di Maria! Oh, another goal! You just cannot keep them down. And it sets up a furious finish. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left, and just one goal between the sides. Good move in the making from France. Coman, very quick thinking there. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. They need to get bodies back. Di Maria, he's in behind. Oh, a goal to level it up in the closing stages. Who's going to claim the trophy? It's an open question here. Well, let's have a look at this pass from Di Maria. He has so much vision. And what an emphatic strike it is from Lionel Messi. Hit with his laces. It's a great goal. Well, it has taken a Herculean effort for them to get back to level pegging under these trying circumstances. On the attack, is there to be late drama? Oh, a save! Must take the lead here! Oh, a goal! And how important could that be? Maybe it's a story of one hand on the trophy at this stage of the final. A huge moment.
Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately, it dropped straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. decided to add on a minimum of five minutes Lionel Messi they get forward but time is very much against them here will he finish and Varane foiling them one block after another is it going to be a goal Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Marcus Tuham. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. Oh, a superb save. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up. So back in business here, the first period of extra time and it might well come down to mental fortitude. Who wants this more? Coman on to Mbappe well the supporters think it's on oh magnificent reaction <laughs> taken short it's been aimed towards the front first and the keeper more than equal to it growing pressure here and another corner Who can they pick out? The high press was on, and the chance is on. Well, good defending, clattered out of there. Well, he's got past his man. And he's in. And still an opportunity. A chance to nudge in front. Corner kick here. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. And you need your defender to take charge. Well, the cross needed to be better than that one. Another corner. Favouring the short one. And the cross smuggled away. It might still be problematic. Hernandez. To jump in front. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. Delivering it. And he succeeds in scraping it off the line. Happy to take on the shot. And the keeper there to deal with it. Well, a corner right on the back of the last one. It's a short one. Fine cross into the middle. And a no-nonsense clearance. Turan. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Di Maria. It has to be. How did he manage to reach that? Hugo Lloris. Well, they fancy a short one. Marcos Acuna. Can he put them in front? Oh, he wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal. Keeper has it now. 
Well, it's been complete domination for France in the last 15 minutes and have got the ball into some really good positions. You just feel it's only a matter of time before they get their goal. Yes, really going so well for them and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Could be a chance to break here. So two minutes to be added on at the end. The high press was very much on. Well, but that wanting to put too fine a point on it. That goes down as a tame effort and easy for the keeper. Mbappe. Incisive pass from Mbappe. Oh, surely. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Mbappe. A chance to whip it in. And the block by Otamendi. <laughs> Who can they pick out? <laughs> Half time in extra time, and still they are level. Well, on they go. Second period of extra time is underway. Now far from a smooth challenge. Now will the referee produce a card? And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. And they need to get tighter here. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. Goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Now, options are plenty. But it stopped a promising attack in its tracks. And you wouldn't be surprised if there's a card coming out here. Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. Turam, a good pressure high up the pitch. William Saliba. Kingsley Coman, and the keeper caught there. Whipped in by Griezmann, struggling to get it away. Coman, a goal! Real excitement, a back and forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, here it is again, and the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area, just poor defending all round. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Tension building still level. Takes the shot! of ground to cover, splendid save well this forthcoming corner might just do it could be their last chance to hit the front in the dying moments Di Maria and blocked for now well a classic example of how to intercept well the counter chance looks very real will they profit from this situation Gonna get a try. Corner conceded. It came off the defender. Going 
short. Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. But a good place to win it back, and let's see what it leads to. Gives it a go! Well, a really important piece of goalkeeping at this stage. Well, it's such a key moment in the game. That's a really good save. Now, how about the short corner? And thwarted there, following the cross. Well shown inside. Superbly read and executed. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. On the attack, is there to be late drama? Very straightforward for Hugo Lloris. Intercepting it intelligently. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. That's really good and effective physical play. And he really read that brilliantly. Griezmann. Body on the line. Well, a fantastic final. And it's going to end in the most nerve-shredding way possible with a penalty shootout. And now it is all about the penalty shootout. And the keeper makes the all-important save. What a big moment. He's gambled on direction and won. Oh, he saved it. And the keeper denies them from the spot. Clinical, as always, in front of goal. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. And confidently converted. Almost intolerable pressure. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And now he knows what's on the line. If he scores, they win. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. Well, what an end into a very good tournament, and I think they fully deserve to win it. Maybe not in this manner, though, but it was great entertainment. It certainly was, and they're not going to forget this in a hurry. A proud moment for everyone involved with the club, but for their opponents, it's a case of trying to forget and move on as quickly as possible. Well, I think we should give them some credit, too. They played their part in what was an excellent contest. Some of their football was brilliant. Yes, fair play, Stuart. The party in full swing now. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here. France, the world champions. It takes a massive effort to win back-to-back -back World Cups. But Stuart, that's what France have done. And they fully deserve it as well. They've been excellent throughout the tournament. The coach has done the right things. They've had a good team spirit. And just think of those fans. They've got right behind this team. Brilliant for them.